Malaysian airline flight 370 disappeared on the 8th of March 2014 and nobody seems to know where the airplane has gone. Allegedly, the co-pilot, Fariq Abdul Hamid, spoke the last words uttered from the missing plane. He said, All right, good night. And that was the last that was ever heard from him, the plane, and 238 other passengers and crew members. Because of the tragic and mysterious nature of this event, I've chosen to paint the co-pilot in the style of Marlene Dumas. Marlene Dumas is a painter who explores identity through portraiture. She works from photographic sources. I laid out the co-pilot, my photographic source, on the left of the screen and I've arranged three small images of Marlene Dumas's paintings in the centre to use as a reference material. To begin, I'll mix a black from brown and blue and start my painting from a base layer. I use water to dilute the watercolour to establish the shape of the face. I then block in dark hair and features of the uniform. I place the eyes, nose and mouth on the wet surface and allow them to bleed into the face. I launch a loose dark line down the left of the face to define the cheek and ear. I work back into the eyes to restore definition. I work on the shadows of the chin and neck and plant the tie underneath. I cast a subtle, dilute yellow hue on the left in the background and balance it with a similar hue to the right on the shoulder. I use a small brush to adapt features of the mouth and make the collar more prominent. Whilst the paint is still wet, marks can be altered and tweaked, so I return again to the eyes and nose for emphasis. I add broad washes to enrich the shadows and finally adjust that tie. This is one method of using the style of Marlene Dumas to paint a portrait in watercolour.